hello guys and welcome back so in this lecture we will import a pro builder free asset which is provided by unity so first let's save this scene so go to file and select save scene as and we will name it game scene and then we will go to window and select asset store so let it load so here just type pro builder and you will see this pro builder unity technologies so click on it and here and click on this import button now you may be downloading it for the first time so you will get a download button so click on download button and after that you will see an import button so just click on import and it will prepare and now we want everything in this and just click on import now click here I made a backup again and just let it continue okay so now the pro builder is imported so let's go to scene and here let's go to tools in pro builder let's select pro builder window and this window will pop up so what we will do is we will dock it here like this and we will just reduce it and now just save the scene with the help of ctrl s now click on new shape and we want a plane and let's let's click on build plane and let's close this window and now if your position is not 0 at 0 0 0 then you can just click on this gear icon here and click on reset and and just select this material here and let's make it little dark like this and we don't want it to be glossy so let's make it 0 and let's set its size to 100 in X and 100 in cell and let's select this Y here to get a top angle view and let's zoom out with the help of scroll button and let's adjust the texture tiling so let's set it to phi and phi let's change the X value so make it 500 uh, negative 500 and negative 500 on set now select the camera and let's set its position so make its y to 36 its z minus 30 x rotation 58 and these are the values which i have found are better for this angle and let's select our plane and let's increase tiling to 10 by 10 or maybe more 15 by 15 okay now select direction light and let's set the intensity to 0 0.8 and let's go to window and click on lightning and select settings so now let's drag and dock it here and now you can see our environment has real time lightning on and bake lightning illumination on so we don't want this we just untick them and we don't want auto generate also so just untick it now here in skybox material let's set it to none and source will be skybox let it be skybox now you can see our scene how it looks we don't have any skybox in it and let's select the plane let's go to inspector and see okay the plane we don't want it to cast shadows so set it to off so guys now our scene is ready uh, so i will see you in the next lecture so thank you